now actually coming to the stage, which is right over here to my right, Mr. Mike Withrow. Um, please welcome Mike as he's going to perform an original song honoring George. This seems to become a leadership tradition which Mike started when he came up with the idea of musically honoring the honoree. And did anybody know in the crowd that Mike has performed with Eric Clapton and John Lennon? <laughs> I'm just kidding, he didn't perform <laughs> But I'll bet he's pretty good. Actually, I've heard he's quite good. So, Mike, your turn. Well, thank you, Jerry. <laughs> what the hell is your name in <laughs> Okay, I want to make it, before I start, I want to make it perfectly clear that I will not be doing opera. <laughs> okay, thank you. Uh, when we got together to uh, organize this uh, party a couple of months ago, I asked George's son, George, uh, what kind of music does your father like? And he said, well, he kind of likes uh, country and western. I think that's what he said, country and western. I said, well, any particular artist? He says, yeah, this guy, that guy, that guy. But George Jr. said to me, if I never hear the song The Gambler again, I'll be very happy. So um, I decided to do this song to the tune of The Gambler. I call it a song for George. Now, if you look in your, uh, in your uh, programs, the, um, the song is written in the back there, and um, I'm going to ask you to join along on the uh, chorus because I can, I'm going to need all the help that I can get. Everybody hear that? Yeah, I don't know the <laughs> <laughs> On the warm summer's evening, in a spot for celebration, the Morgan Hill community came to honor their old friend. It was good old George Fiala, Mushroom king among us who gives and gives and donates like the world is gonna end. He thought no one would notice that he'd do it all in quiet. But leadership's been watching, and that's why we're here tonight. So it's time George got it coming. You can bet he got it coming. We're going to thank him, and we're going to do it right. All right, here comes the chorus. You know it, right? He does bok choy, ginger carrots, eggplant, leeks, green onions, fennel, garlic, peppers, all the strawberries, too. But the biggest thing he's known for is a whole big lot of mushrooms. In fact, you might say George is a real fun guy guru. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> fun guy. I made, I made that part up. <laughs> so like George says when he's asked, I think that I can do that. You can bet that he has done that and a whole lot of it more. So settle back and listen about a neighbor we will honor. And the best darn thing about it is that he lives just right next door. Now folks round here all know he's a fountain head of kindness. Gives so much to others that his banker goes boo-hoo. <laughs> He's given Fountain Oaks to St. Catherine's, Louise and Roses for fundraising parties, and that's just to name a few. All right, do it with me. He does bok choy, ginger carrots, eggplant, leeks, green onions, fennel, garlic, peppers, all the strawberries too. But the biggest thing he's known for is a whole big lot of mushrooms. In fact, you might say George is a real fun guy guru. <laughs> so when I'm finished speaking, and we're all finished eating, and the banners are all pulled down, and the chairs are put away, 
George will always be there, like the rock of Gibraltar, doing good and helping others, like he does most every day. All right, let's sell it. He does hot George ginger carrots, onion wings, and onions, and all garlic peppers, olive strawberries too. But the biggest thing he's known for is a whole big lot of mushrooms. In fact, you might say George is a real fun guy guru. He does good <laughs> ginger carrots, olives, leeks, green onions, fennel, garlic, peppers, olive strawberries too. But the biggest thing he's known for is a whole big lot of mushrooms. In fact, you might say George is a real fun guy guru.